Hey, what's going on YouTube? Uh, coming back at you with another video. Today's video, we're gonna talk about this guy right here. This is the Z-Man Jackhammer Chatterbait. In this video, you guys will see I caught a nice fish, probably six pounds, maybe six and a half, seven pounds on this exact same setup here. It's got a little bit of chartreuse in it and I got a trailer on it. This is the Salt Strong Slam Series Slam Shady. This is a three and a half inch bait. Very durable, I've caught 10 or 12 fish on one of these trailers. Um, I actually burned through a whole pack of them um, and I got a couple more from my brother, but killer trailer, I've been really doing some damage on this uh, Z-Man Jackhammer Chatterbait here. You'll see in this video the fish that I caught, I, uh, I wanted to give it a little bit of water and I, and I put the fish back in the water and, and was gonna weigh it and she shook out of my hand so I uh, I screwed up the release in the way, so I never did get a weight on her, but I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say she was probably six and a half pounds. Maybe a little more. Could be seven, who knows. But killer killer bait. I've been doing a lot of damage on this in the last month, caught a couple five and a half pounders on it, and that one you'll see in this video. But um, I highly recommend it. If you can get your hands on a pack of these salt strong uh, slam series paddle tail. This one is the Alabama Leprechaun. This is like a fluke style, the green with a little bit of red and gold flake. Um, you can put that on his trailer too. I haven't really experimented with this one yet, but I will give it a shot eventually. But let me show you guys the rod I'm using. This is a uh, this is a Browning Maxis. It's a heavy action rod. I've had this for a while and haven't really used it that much, but I'm telling you. I'm really finding out that this this thing is like the perfect uh, chatterbait rod. Um, I think this goes for about a hundred bucks at Bass Pro. This is this year's this rod is probably four or five years old, but I got it pair, paired up with a Lose Super Duty um, six four to one. Yeah, Lose Super Duty six four to one. You guys know my videos. I love the Lose reels. They're great reels. Uh, my favorite reel by far, but I think the 6 4 to 1 is a good gear ratio for chatterbaits. Um, you can even go a 7 to 1 if you want to uh, reel a little faster. I do think I probably miss a few fish because I'm reeling a little bit too slow. But um, anyway, the man jackhammer chatterbait. You cannot deny this thing. This is an awesome chatterbait. Definitely my go to. Uh, got a couple white ones. I think this is a 3 8 ounce. Um, I hear they're coming out with a new one that's got a clear blade on it, um, so it'll be interesting to see how that that one works out. But they're not cheap; they're pretty expensive as far as uh, chatterbaits go. I want to say these are like 15 bucks. So some people think that's too much money, but I'm going to tell you what: as many fish as I've caught on it, I'm definitely not going to complain. So check out the video. See you guys in the next one. That's a big one. Look at that donkey. Look at that one, guys. <laughs> Guess what your boy caught it on? Z-Man Chatterbait. 
Slam Shady trailer. <laughs> yes, sir. Look at that. Thick. Look at his fin. Z Man Chatterbait with the Slam Shady Salt Strong Paddle Tail. That is a nice, healthy fish. Let's get away on this girl. Say pushing six. Oh, six. Oh, damn it. Oh, well. What a rookie. What a rookie. Oh, well. <laughs> Woo! Well, <clears throat> so much for getting a weight on her. I'd say she's about six pounds. Whew. Well, that's if I just blew the release on that. I tried to. <laughs> Tried to give her some water and wear, and she shook right out of my hand. So, oh well. I say she's, uh, I don't know, six pounds, maybe a little bit more. Oh, slam shady paddle tail, Jack Z Man Jackhammer Chatterbait. This thing has been doing some damage in the last few weeks. I really like this thing. Yeah.